just your friendly neighborhood past life regressionist. And I want to talk about how the higher self promotes you having hobbies. So 99% of the time, someone who's getting one of these sessions, usually they have questions they want answered or they want clarity or insight on themes in their life or situations they're going through or have gone through. And most of the time, it comes with an emotional kind of baggage. And while it can be very healing and very insightful to get answers to questions you might have had for a very long time, oftentimes the higher self will provide some homework, we'll say. And this homework can be very important. It can be a new meal plan, it can be an exercise plan, but it can also be, hey, you need to go and join that softball team that you were looking at. You need to sign up for that class your friend emailed you about. She used to paint. She doesn't paint anymore. She needs to get the paint out again. She used to dance and now she hardly listens to music. So these are just examples of what the higher self may come through and say that somebody needs to do in order to kind of meet the higher self halfway because the higher self is doing its own job behind the scenes more on an energetic level. So if the higher self is doing more of the energy work behind the scenes, you, the person, is in charge of doing the physical act of whatever the homework may be. So this is applicable to that whole mind, body, spirit thing because as you start engaging and activating physical levels and layers of yourself that you're not used to doing, your higher self is behind the scenes getting the mental and emotional parts kind of plugged in so it can all be working all together. Now you might be curious, like I was at first, what happens when somebody doesn't maintain their homework, their routine. And honestly, if somebody's not doing their part or doing their homework, we do see that progress will slow down or stop. So these sessions are not just a one and done most of the time, you have to make an effort afterwards. But that's usually what someone's looking for is a change in their lifestyle for the better, plus the incentive to keep it going. And no, not all homework given by the higher self is to be maintained throughout the entire course of a lifetime, but it definitely is meant to shift you out of ever going back to where you were. But usually you don't need a session to tell you to go try something new. It's that feeling that pulls you to try something new. So hopefully it's helpful and I'll be back with more. Bye.